everyone, I'm Phoenix. Nice to meet you. Shake's hand. In today's video, I will be doing the sip, flip, or flip, sip. The flip, sip, or slip challenge as inspired by the Dolan Twins. So the rules of this challenge are as follows. The participant of the game must flip a water bottle. Very impressive, I know. If the bottle lands on its base or bottom, naughty, oh, then that victorious person will not have to sip or slip anything. You don't have to do anything that's a bit icky, a bit gross. Which is a bit difficult seeing as it's just one person playing this game. A condiment that I've written down on a piece of paper I see so you can't see the name of said condiment then you have to take a sip of that condiment ie on said <laughs> tablespoon <laughs> <laughs> or I've asked some of the people on my social media to send in some truths that I would be prepared or not be prepared to slip if I refuse to sip, it will make sense as we go on. So, here we go. First try. Am I going to land the bottle? It's 99% unlikely. Let's put it that way. So, drum roll please. I've picked the condiment. Oh my god. I swear, this is the only one that I did not. <laughs> I actually. <gasps> okay, it's. You can't probably read that. It's Branston Pickle. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know if I can do it. Okay, so before I set myself up with a tablespoon full of Branston Pickle, which <laughs> going to avoid at all costs, <sighs> the thought of it makes me physically feel ill. Has any comment in the comment section below whether or not you like Branston Pickle or if you've never heard of it. So I've asked my friend to log into my social media and check the DMs of questions that we've got and um, now I'm going to ask her to send me one. I'm going to text her and see what my first slip is. <gasps> First question, please. Is that not the most satisfying noise? I think so. So I've received the question and it is, what's the most embarrassing thing I've ever done? Okay, does that include the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to me? Because if it does, then I can't. Okay, let's go. Story time! <laughs> I was sitting in this room, which is the living room of the house that I live in. And I was kind of in between my mum, my dad, and we was obviously looking on the internet for a film to watch because I wanted to watch something that was um, particularly new. <laughs> on the internet. So we found the film that we were looking for. I can't remember what it was. Got a long story short, a advertisement for a particularly raunchy website popped up on a tab and I wasn't quick enough to press the X to get off the tab and so on a rather large screen popped up a rather large set of legs like that. On that day I saw too much, my parents saw too much and the worst thing is that we saw it together. can't look anyone in the eye after something really really awkward's happened you can't you just can't look at them i went upstairs to bed after that anyway so now that that question's answered let's move on to the next bottle flip i'm trying oh magic magic pot <laughs> cinnamon i i kind of ran out of creativity 
with all the condiments. I thought they were a bit boring, so I thought I'd kind of combine the cinnamon challenge with this challenge, and I've never done a cinnamon challenge before. So this might go terribly wrong, because everything in this room is soft or fluffy. I'm not sure how my mum will react if I've coughed cinnamon all over the place. So my option to slip is, what's the 200th photo on my camera roll? I'm gonna check what is my 200th photo on my camera roll, and then I'll decide whether or not I'm doing the cinnamon challenge or I'm showing you, okay? We've reached 200. I think I'm going to have to sip or breathe in the cinnamon. So let's go. Pray for me. So here I have the teaspoon of cinnamon. I feel like after this, I'm never gonna like cinnamon ever again. And that's really quite stressing me out. Once again, we have the pot of condiments. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> so my option to slip and to avoid sipping the seafood sauce is, do I have bad foot odor? No, I don't smell. Next, we have three left. Oh, one jumped out of the pot. I guess it's destiny. We have mayonnaise. And this is where I let out um, quite gross truth. I actually really like mayonnaise. When I was younger, I used to have tablespoons of it by itself because I liked it so much. Bear in mind, I've never eaten an egg in my life. Double standards. Let's go. So my option to slip is, what is your biggest pet peeve ever in the world? You get the point. If you do this, I will still love you. I will still care for you as a person. It just might take me a while to get over my pet peeve. So you know when you're sitting next to somebody, say for example, if you're in a classroom, and then the person next to you has a drink of water. Or even if it's any kind of drink, not necessarily water, no problem. So said person is drinking their drink, and this is what happens next. <sighs> Nothing aggravates me more than when somebody does that after they've drank. Now I swear that may be the only thing that actually gets on my nerves. Not many things actually do frustrate me. Trying to stay positive, you know? <laughs> now, <laughs> Plot twist. I might actually just take a spoonful of mayonnaise just to actually prove to you that I don't mind the taste of it. Let's do it. So we have mayonnaise. Is everyone watching? I love it. 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 Anyway, next. There's, ooh, there's two left. One just fell out. Is it destiny to pick up the one that fell out or the one that stayed in? I'm gonna go with the one that stayed in. Anyway, now I don't think this is too bad. It's mint sauce. This could go one of two ways. So my option to slip is, what's the grossest thing I've ever done? Oh, I can't, I can't, I can't do that one. See, <laughs> mint sauce it is. Oh. oh, this is actually massive. So that, I'm afraid, is the end of this week's video. This was pretty much a one-time thing. Um, if you enjoyed it and you want me to make another one, then I will do so. If you enjoyed this video, then give it a thumbs up. Um, comment in the, the thing, the bit below. What is it called? In the comment section below. Is that it? If you like this, then give it a like. If you didn't, don't be a hater, okay? Share the love, share the love, share the love. And I'll um, maybe see you next week. I don't know. Let's see how this goes. <laughs>